Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So I thought today we would experience the joys of parenthood. I have a sim here, her name is Veronica. She lives in a fairly small house. I mean, actually it's a pretty good size, but it's a small house for her family. She has seven children. And for today's video, we're going to be playing as Veronica for 48 hours to see how she gets on keeping all of her kids happy. She's going to be responsible for making sure all of the children are fed, they're all in bed at a decent time. She's going to be in charge of doing all the laundry. It's going to be a bit of a shit show for Veronica. Unfortunately, the dads aren't in the picture. But at least we don't have to work because we do get child support. We've got a bit of money in the bank. So we do have the time to dedicate to being a sole parent. So Veronica has three children. This is her firstborn, his name's Tommy. Then after Tommy came Molly. After Molly, we got little Eddie, who looks like he's gonna turn out to be a little shit. And then a couple of years later, little Lily came into the picture. And then within just under a year, they welcomed little Zack. Little Zack's a bit weird. He spies on the other kids in the shower. He's just an odd child. Following Zack, Tilly was born. And then the youngest and newest addition is Vivian who looks like she may have shot herself. So let's see how we get on enjoying every aspect of parenting until about lunchtime on Saturday. Veronica, I noticed the first thing you queued up was to sit down and watch TV. I think you're a bit more optimistic than I am about how this is gonna go. I think probably we should start by potty training some of the little ones so that you're not left finding dirty nappies hanging around the house. Is that little shit Eddie still making a mess? Oh, you are the bane of my life. Okay, Veronica, as soon as you finish potty training, you need to come clean this mess up. You don't want the neighbours to start getting judgy. This kid seems like she's a bit hungry. Maybe we should feed one of them. Lily. Yeah, that's the one. Can you try and go a bit faster? What are we thinking? Apple crackers for dinner? Let's give her... Oh, ham and cheese sandwich. There we go. That's a nutritious meal. This kid's angry. Why are you so angry? Unwanted sibling. Oh, you're gonna be hard work, aren't you? How can you be annoyed just because you have a sibling? Children are a gift. Oh, it's times like this I just wish I'd fucking swallowed you. Oh, look at her though, she's intuitively feeding this one. Didn't even need my input. Good job, good job. How about you get that kid out and then go and use the bathroom? And then maybe what we'll do is we'll feed the last toddler, Zach, and then we'll serve up proper dinner for the other kids. Come on, Zach. Oh, look at that kid doing the washing up. Oh, Tommy, you're a good egg. Okay, let's serve dinner. We will just serve mac and cheese for everyone. Do something easy. Probably at some point we should check on the baby and let these let the toddlers out. I think we're doing well so far. It's not even 7 p.m. And, you know, half the kids are fed. Poison food. <laughs> oh, that took a sinister turn, didn't it? Right, let's let the toddlers out, call to meal, and then eat some food. Okay, this is going really well. The toddlers are all getting a bit tired. It probably is toddler bedtime, so we'll just pop them all to sleep. Come on, Veronica, get your finger out your ass. Sit down then, kiddies, we're going to do a little story. That's right, everyone listen up. Once upon a time, there was a dinosaur with a flower on its head, and everyone bullied it because it looked stupid. But the dinosaur didn't care, because it had dreams of its own. And if you want something bad enough, your dream might come true. And one day, Lily, your dreams might come true. And maybe one day, I'll stop dreaming about running through a motorway at rush hour. Sweet dreams, my baby. Right, toddlers asleep. That is some good parenting right now. How's the baby getting on? Baby's awake, but she's keeping quiet, so that's important. Right, you kids need to go to sleep as well. Oh, fuck, the baby's crying. Right, why don't we try and all go to bed at the same time? Wouldn't that be nice? Oh, fuck, the baby's still fucking crying. There we go. Can we all get to sleep at the same time? Oh, yeah. Oh, beautiful. I wonder how long this lasts. My money is on maybe, like, two hours. Change the diaper. Feed it. Any laundry in the basket? Oh, yeah. Always laundry. Well, as soon as you finish cleaning out that potty, you better put a wash on and then make some breakfast. That's right. I don't know why you're still in your pyjamas. This is not going to be a pyjama day for you. There we go. 
I kind of feel like I'm enjoying the calm before the storm. Either that or I'm just really good at this game. Because we haven't had too many hiccups yet. 5am and the kids are still sleeping. God, what a blessing. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, you fucked it. Uh-oh. Now Veronica's on fire. This might actually end a lot quicker than I thought it would. How could you fuck that up? It was only like egg on toast. Oh, do you know what? Just put the laund put the laundry on. Put the laundry on. Do something you can't fuck up. The kids are going to have to have cereal. The fire's spreading. <sighs> God damn it. The fire's reignited. <laughs> it's reignited on the floor. It's probably going to spread because the fireman is just complaining about the smell of the gone-off food rather than doing his fucking job. The sofa's on fire. <laughs> this is... Isn't this just your one job, fireman? Oh, it got the coffee table as well. This fire is spreading. Why are you cheering? You did a terrible, terrible job. Fuck's sake, this is going to cost me all my fucking child benefit money. <sighs> Damn it. Look at the state of me. I look a mess. Kids, you're gonna have to go to fucking breakfast club or something. I haven't got time to make you another breakfast. Right, which one of you left skidder pants behind the toilet? Did you think I wouldn't find it? I think I'm gonna need to take a shower. Someone send over a school bus for these kids. They're all hungry. You know what? Just get leftovers. Just get leftovers. Oh, and Zach's shit his pants as well. Come on then, you little creep. Let's change your diaper. I'll be happier when these kids are off on the school bus. When the kids are off to school, I'll be a lot happier. Oh, look at that kid doing the washing up. What good kids. Their needs are okay. Yeah, they're all fine. They're all fine. That's good. They're going to school in a fairly good mood. How are the other kids doing? They're all sad because of the fire. Zach needs a bath. Why are you having a bath? I told you to take a shower. You don't have the luxury of time to have a bath. This place is a mess. Right, okay, I have a plan. Serve fruit salad, and then that way any kid that's hungry can just grab some food, and then maybe you can have a little bite to eat, and then we'll give the stinky one a bath. Right, Veronica, this is a simple fruit salad, okay? So try not to fuck this up. Okay, perfect. They're all getting hungry now, so we will call to meal. Who is that on the phone? In lab, Eddie's science experiment exploded and made a big mess, along with frightening another student. We think he did it on purpose. <laughs> oh, boys will be boys. Okay, all the toddlers are going to grab food. That's good. So they're all going to be fed. Why don't you watch TV while you eat? And then we need to unload, move the laundry to the dryer. That's right. I bet there's more laundry in that basket. Yeah, endless. And, uh... Give bath to Zach. There we go. Oh, wait, wait. Before you do that, dry the laundry. Turn on the dryer. Then give Zach a bath. Oh, I can hear the baby crying. What does she want? Change of diaper. Okay. Oh, she is a good little mum, really, isn't she? I'm going to teach you everything you need to know about life, little one. You don't have to grow up to be nice. You just have to make a lot of money. Right, let's go change Vivian's diaper, and then I notice some of the kids aren't having fun, so I'm just going to put the kids' network on, and that way, if the kids end up watching it, they'll get some fun from it. All right, all right. God, crying about everything all the time. What is it with babies? Right, how are the needs doing? She's doing okay. She's warmed to having a sibling now. Zach's not doing too good. He could do with sitting on the potty. Oh, actually, he's right in the middle of filling his diaper, so I guess we were a bit late on the mark there, but okay, fine. So we'll change his diaper. What else? Oh, he's tired. Okay. So he's fine, except a little bit tired. She's fine, except a bit tired. And she needs to be potty trained. Okay. Why are you crying when you look so fabulous? Walking around the house in a bathrobe and sunglasses. You're my favourite child, Tilly. I might try and see if I can get them all to, like, watch a movie together when the kids come home. That would be nice. Right, how's the laundry getting on? Did I not even dry it? Oh, for fuck's sake. Dry the laundry. What's wrong with you? Dry the laundry, take a shower, and then we need to... Im do not slam that fridge door. And then we need to influence these kids to do their homework. Every single one of them. Do your homework. Right, you guys do all your homework, and then I will... 
Oh, do you know what? I'm kind of tempted to order pizza. No, no, I'll cook, I'll cook. We'll just go with franks and beans. Did you dry the laundry? Oh, she... Okay, good. The laundry's going. Brilliant, brilliant. It only took three times. We'll make some dinner and we'll all eat it in front of the TV. Like a proper family. Oh, this isn't so bad. You kids. You're all a little blessing to me. Except Zach. He's so creepy. Okay. Call to meal and then watch, watch a movie with all the kids. There we go. Get your food. Watch TV and stuff your faces, okay? I'm guessing the three toddlers have just taken themselves to bed. <laughs> yeah, okay, great. And their needs are okay as well. How about the kids? Hungry, smelly, just smelly, and this kid's fine, okay. Well then, you can go and take a shower. We're gonna try and get everyone to bed at the same time again, because that worked very effectively last time. And then you can unload and put the laundry away. There we go, perfect, perfect. And then you, kid, you can go and take a shower. Why haven't you done your homework, even though I influenced you two? Do it right now. That fridge is getting a bit smelly. Maybe you should clean out the spoiled food. Okay, needs are looking pretty good. Maybe we can enjoy a little bubble bath while the kids do their homework. And then we'll go see what Vivian wants. Oh my god, look how tired she is. Oh dear. Right, we'll, we'll just take care of the baby and then you can go to sleep, okay? We'll just pop the kids to bed. I don't know what you think you're doing, Caleb. You can fuck right off, mate. I've got enough on my plate as it is. Okay, I think we have everyone going to bed. Ah, oh, two nights in a row where everyone's asleep at the same time, even the baby. Oh, genius. Oh no. Oh shit, I knew it was too good to be true. We've got some monsters under the bed. Right. Veronica, you better wake up. Spray the monster under the bed. Just as I thought I'd get one peaceful night's sleep. Right, kids. Back to sleep. Come on now. Stop being little pricks about this. You're full children. You're waking up in the night. The toddlers, not a stir. Grow up. Oh, now the kids had a nightmare. Go to fucking sleep. Go to sleep. Kids are fucking killing me, man. Oh, baby's crying. So I guess I'm not going to have even just one night's sleep tonight, or... Nah, that's too greedy, right, kids? Just to have one peaceful night. Baby's crying again. Right, okay, Veronica, you're going to have to get up, change the baby's nappy. And you know what, kids? You were a pain in the ass last night, so no eggs for you. You can have fruit salad. That's what you get. These toddlers are very hungry. <laughs> I'm doing the best I can! Okay, let's call to meal... So you toddlers come get some food and I'll change this shitty nappy. Do all the toddlers have food? Yes, okay, good, good. Oh dear, this kid is really not doing so too good. You know what might make you all feel a bit better? What if we watch TV? Okay, this kid needs to use the potty and she needs a bath. So let's just, let's just try and do that, shall we? And I can make at least one toddler happy. Already that laundry basket is so full that it can't even take any more clothes. How are the kids doing? Are the kids all okay at least? Yeah, the kids are all fine. Okay, it's just the toddlers. One needs a bath. One of them is A-OK. -okay. okay, okay. He just needs a change of diaper. And this one just really needs a bath. And I'm sure by the time I've done all that, the baby will start crying. Yep, yeah, right on cue. Just started crying. Fucking predictable. Right, we'll bathe this toddler. We'll go check on the baby. And we'll do... Oh, Vivian just aged up. She can be a charmer. That's handy. Don't have to check on the baby now. She's doing just fine. And on that note, I think we've done 48 hours. That was fucking hard work. <laughs> Single parent with seven children. And on that note, I'm going to end this video here. <laughs> Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.